Slants. Hi, Slants Yulimov, editor chief of PCMag.com, and I'm here at the iPad launch. This is the iPad. You're checking it out. We've got the full run through. It's quite amazing. It's quite thin. It does a whole bunch of stuff. So stay tuned. We're going to run through this whole device. Double click, come back to the message. So you get a from the device, yeah. So here's that PDF that came in with as an attachment. Just have the PDF icon and then you get a full screen view of that PDF document. Okay, so it's got to be on this point. It's good if you get the big, the big uh, keypad. It's volume's at max. Yeah, the speaker's on the bottom. It's pretty loud in here, so it may be hard to hear, but if you hold it up here, you can pop it there. I my ears on the back of my bag. You know, with the keyboard, you plug in the keyboard. So you go to the bottom of the device. Okay. Okay. So videos are really nice. Yeah, we have a few movies on here. You can jump right to a chapter. It's on a yeah, wireless network here. Yeah. And you can double tap to zoom in, so make it full screen. Oh, okay. There you go. So try to double tap. You can, you can pinch. You can do all the, the usual uh, yeah. gestures that you can on an iPhone. I mean, it just looks gorgeous on there. You double tap to get back out, and then tap once, and you'll see the controls pop up. So you can scrub through the video, you can click done if you want to go back. Yep. Okay, there's speakers. Yes. So on the bottom of the device, right there, you see the, uh, the speakers, that's the 30-pin connector. And of course, you can connect a, a headphone at the top. So if you have uh, if you have your own set of headphones, oh, okay. there's a, a microphone right there. A microphone, and okay. There's the uh, right on/off switch, yeah. Okay. And then volume on the side here. Uh huh. And then a uh, volume on/off. Oh, volume on/off. Mm -hmm. Of course. Okay. okay. So you can mute the device. If you want, the store's not mine yet. But if you want to see what it looks like, just drop on the yep. bell. Yeah. Sure. Bye. So yeah, just tap once to get into an article, and you can double tap to fill the screen with, for example, that text there. Oh, okay. There you go. I figured I didn't know you guys were but I knew someone would do it. You just save yourself $250. Yeah. So you can also rotate it if you want to see uh, an image of the split page. Uh, maybe I'm on. Trying to get to a uh, story. Actually, New York Times is nice. If you click the bookmarks icon there, tap that. New York Times is the first bookmark. There you go. Hmm. It's a good story to pick. <laughs> so if I double click. Yeah, you double tap and it fills the screen. It's so easy to just get around the article. just tapping on well, what's really nice is that these applications have been rewritten. So, for example, if you go into calendar, tap yeah. calendar. Okay. So you have a week. And then let's uh, go to books. So here's your bookshelf with all the books that you've downloaded, and you just tap a book, and it opens up full screen. Will it be free like this? Then the email will show you something different. Is there two products in the absolute version? Just curious. No, okay. But I'm, I'm sort of, I'm sort of yeah, and you can, uh, you can drag it slowly. There you go. So it's like a real page. And then you can tap once. I can also do that. Mm -hmm. You can go back. I tap once. You get some controls at the top so you can change the font size or the font type. Tap Facebook. And here is the Facebook app. Full screen. So you come to your home page here. You can see. Uh, should there... Yeah, I mean it's really, really. Good. Yeah, these are all really great seamless way to kind of iPhone apps, which just they just work. So let's see if we go to this is pretty cool. Star Wars. This is set up as basically a. Uh, 
an app that lets you view and identify stars. As you hold this up, you can oh, wow. see how <laughs> it understands that you're looking up at the sky. And you can, it doesn't know where you are, right? It yes, know, yes, because there's a built-in compass. Yeah, exactly. So as you move this around, oh it can tell where in the sky right, you're looking. That's you awesome. Tap a star to identify that's it. Cool. Oh my gosh. Okay, really that's cool. cool. You can pinch to zoom out, pinch to zoom in, you can move around the sky.